which I'm going to pronounce it that way the entire time. So if I'm wrong, so be it. Kayla is sick. I arrived at 11 p.m. So I'm also in a semi-zombie state and we're just gonna wander around. So let's wander around. <laughs> about how in the Scottish gallery there were lots of paintings with rainbows and I was like I feel like we never really see rainbows anymore in art and well wouldn't you know there is a rainbow we manifested it obviously navigator for this. We are in the Grey Kirk, Grey Yard, Grey Friars Kirkyard. And this is apparently where JK Rowling walked around and got a lot of inspiration for, I stepped in a lot of mud, um, for like names in the Harry Potter books. So we are currently searching for some people. We walked around once, didn't find any. We're gonna walk around with directions now, thanks to Google. So let's go find them. fish and chips from the local fish fry or the local fry, which was great. But there was also a man in there who was talking to us and he was very nice. And then he said something about, oh, you must be Irish because of my hair color. And I told him, oh, I thought in Scotland I was not rare. That's why I was excited to come here. And he said, no, my hair color is rare. So waste of a trip. Uh, we're going home tomorrow. And that's, that's it. Thanks Edinburgh for nothing. We're leaving. But anyway, no, just kidding. We love it and I'm gonna eat now. Yay. Maybe we should go up. <laughs> that little side glance. I'm moving to New Zealand. What? Yeah. Oh, I <laughs> Good morning from Scotland. Um little bit stuffy. It is officially my summer to autumn transitional cold that I get every year. So it's kind of welcome. It means autumn is coming. Edinburgh is 
beautiful, wonderful. <clears throat> Does it look real? I can't get enough of it. I love it so much. I will move here. But anyway, um, I have been journaling just so I remember everything that is happening, but I also have started doodling. And you guys know that I have been trying to just draw more and kind of get out of my head about it not being perfect, which reminds me, I want to give a shout out to this video's sponsor. Ooh. This video is actually sponsored by Skillshare, if you can believe it. And you should know, but Skillshare is an online learning community. It has over 30,000 different courses from business to art. I've always wanted to use their video and photography editing courses, but because I am on vacation, I decided to look more into their art area. They have a lot of art illustration, a lot of stuff for my iPad, which I'm excited about. But I started this course called Just Draw On Everything. And it basically is just teaching you how to get out of your head and just draw, which is wonderful. Um, there's also an urban architecture sketching course, which I really want to get into. I'm gonna, I took a lot of pictures and when I get home, I wanna like try and sketch them out. And Skillshare is giving away a free two month unlimited access trial to my subscribers um, through the link in the description box, which is really cool of them. And after that, it's only $10 a month. So I will keep you updated on my sketching journey. And yeah, I highly, highly encourage it. I hope when I get home and I'm back in like business mode, um, you will see some improvement in my video editing as well. So anyway, thank you so much Skillshare. Check the link in the description box. <clears throat> we are now going to head out. It's gonna be an eventful day. Gonna drain this tea. Definitely had hobnobs for breakfast. Um, yeah, Scotland is amazing. I'm never leaving. Great, I will see you guys later. specifically said do not touch the plants we're cursed now checked in in a while we have done so much today but it's been raining so it's been a little bit difficult to vlog but i am now at the top of granny's green steps on our way to the castle we were told that we should maybe spend the whole day in the castle but we're kind of thinking we don't necessarily need that we kind of just enjoyed the view of it from below so we're gonna see worst case scenario we can come tomorrow when it will not be raining so we're gonna get out of this rain catch our breath, continue way up. And yeah, so far, I feel like we've been just saying this to each other, but we haven't been saying it to the camera. Edinburgh is blowing our minds. We love it. We've picked out all of our houses, our many new homes. We only have eight, we only have eight yeah. We're basing it mostly on the windows and the doors. <laughs> but um, yeah, anyway, let's go before it closes. Onward. Oh my god. 
it's too dark to see, but there's a very, oh my God. I hate this so much. I, I literally can't see anything. <laughs> for breakfast and now we are going to go climb Arthur's seat. Our feet are very tired but we have to do it so here we go it is a wonderful sunny day a couple clouds in the sky let's go climb a seat updates later but we were way up there we took a wrong way down and then we took the steep way down and now I can't feel my legs but I also can if you know what I mean so now we're heading to food bye Houses, the glass houses here at the Botanical Gardens and each one of them is a very different temperature to help the plants thrive and I have found that I am officially as if we didn't already know I am a moss slash fern in another life because this is the ideal temperature I feel very happy with my green little family I love it worth the six pounds <laughs>
we're getting on the train. Goodbye, Edinburgh. I'm so bouncy. Hold on. You can keep walking. I'm walking slower. Okay, we are getting on the train to Glasgow. Thank you, Edinburgh, for everything. You were beautiful. You were magical. I'm sad to leave you, but Glasgow, here we come. And then out into the wild Scotland frontier. So we've been in Glasgow for less than an hour, an hour maybe. So many redheads of my shade. I'm feeling at home. I'm very happy here. We were looking for cones the whole time, and alas, here it is. So this is our one full day in Glasgow. As you can tell, my cold has changed into manipulating my voice, so please excuse me. We are here at the Kelvin Grove Art Gallery and Museum. We've got tea scheduled. Uh, we got a lot of things. We just had delicious donuts. It looks like a wonderful day. The sky is crazy blue. And um, yeah, let's go, let's go, let's go. been a little bit difficult to vlog but we've decided it was very nice we would like to live in an apartment near Kelvin Grove and there are so many dogs here this is a wonderful place and but now we're heading back to city center and then we're gonna get tea Definitely you. <laughs> night in Glasgow. We actually only had one full day. Um, wish we had a lot more time and we were both kind of at the tail end of our sicknesses so it just felt really nice. We walked around really slowly. We uh, watched a lot of the Great British Bake Off and um, we just sat in the park. Like we were blessed. We had such good weather. There's so much sun um, and in Scotland I hear that's not very common. 
Um, so yeah, I, I wish I did Glasgow a little bit more justice in the vlog. It was kind of hard to capture there. It seems like there's a lot of really interesting like cafes and eateries and stuff like that. Um, but we couldn't eat that much and we just saw a lot of really cool things from the bus window. So it was kind of difficult to film. Um, but the like public art and everything, also the fashion, like everybody here dresses so interestingly. Like there's definitely, um, people take a lot more fashion risks here. There are also so many more redheads than there were in Edinburgh. I was overwhelmed. Um, I've never seen that many people that look like me in my entire life. Um, so that was really interesting. Um, but yeah, starting tomorrow early in the morning, we're going to head out west. We're going to rent a car and um, head out west and then straight north. We're going to hit a couple of the aisles, including the Isle of Skye. But I'm um, going to do that in a separate vlog. Hopefully my voice comes back for that. The trip has been so great. Everyone we've met has been so nice. Um, even though it's been a little difficult understanding everybody, uh, the accents vary. Um, so yeah, it's uh, it's been a trip. It's been wonderful. Uh, thank you again for Skillshare for sponsoring this video. Um, can't believe it. Very, very excited for that. And um, don't forget to check out my link in the description box. I will keep you updated on my sketching. I will uh, get back into that and I will post some more of that on Instagram as I work on them. And uh, yeah, I will see you guys in the next vlog. Thanks you. Thank you as always for joining me. And um, yeah, also thank you to everybody on Instagram who've been giving me um, recommendations and everything for Scotland as we've been here. Thank you, Edinburgh, for being absolutely beautiful. Um, yeah, I'm just, this trip has been really, really great, and we are only halfway through, so I will see you guys in the next half, and yeah, hopefully there are a lot more sheep gonna be out in the country, a lot of green, a lot of mountains, so yeah, I will see you guys then, and thank you for everything. Bye!